Hello everyone, Amud here from your target Common YouTube channel and from this video onward I am starting a new playlist on solving 100 problems of lead code. So in the first programming question I am going to solve this question from lead code which is like sorting the sentence. It says that a sentence is a list of words that are separated by single space with no leading or trailing spaces. Each word consists of lowercase and uppercase English letters. A sentence can be shuffled by appending the one index word position to each word, then rearranging the words in the sentence. Let's directly jump to the example. If you don't understand the problem statement properly, so just read it. What they are saying that they will give you one sentence in which every word will have the actual position. Means this word, this should go first position. That's why it ends with one. Similarly for age, it ends with two. Means it should be like this is a sentence. So they are giving the actual index at end of each word. So what do we need to do? We need to rearrange this sentence to form a correct one. So for this output should be this is a sentence. Similarly, if you see this second example, here also we have first, second, third and fourth. So it should be me, myself and I. So let's talk about the logic. How can we solve the problem? So let me copy this data and go to notepad plus plus. So we can understand that okay somehow we need to read the correct indexes for each word. So obviously we need to get all the words from this sentence. We know that every word is separated by a white space. We can split this sentence using the white space. So after splitting we'll get four words. So first step will be split the sentence by white space. Now we will have one string array. Now we need to iterate the words. We need a data structure where we can store those words in an order. So that later we can combine those words and form a correct sentence. You can use array or list. We know that in list we can have the insertion order. Even in arrays also we can set the value based on the index. So whatever you feel is good you can use it. So second point will be select the data structure to store the words correctly. Third step will be we need to iterate it and get the last character of every word. So suppose when we iterate this one is right. So this will give me two, which will say that this this word should go in second position. So we can use this index to insert the value in the correct position. Just for an example, suppose I have one empty array and here I will have four elements. So when we get the first word, it will return me two. So the correct index will be two minus one because whatever number we will get, we need to do a minus one. Then only I will get the correct index. So it will go. It, this will be zero and this will be first. So my age will come here. Similarly, sentence will go four. Right, so 4 minus 1, 3. So this will be 0 index. 1 we have already 1, then 2, then 3. So here I will get sentence. So obviously there, uh, I gave one extra, so it is not required. Similarly, this should go first. So 1 minus 1, 0. So it will go to the 0th index. And A, it should go to 3rd position. Means 3 minus 1, 2. So 0, 1 and 2. So we need to use this position given in the word to find their correct index. So I have already created one main method and the logic method where I will return the final string. So what is my first step? I need to split. So for that I can use sentence dot split method and here I need to pass the delimiter which will be white space and this will return me one string array. Now I need to create one data structure in which I need to store the words correctly or in correct order. So let's go and create the array first. So I will create a new array a string words with correct position equal to new string. So we know that what should be the length. Length should be the how many words we have. So we can use words dot length. Now I need to iterate it word by word. So I'll use the for loop and it will return me one string. I will name it as like word and word. Now I need to extract the position which is the last character of the word. So I need to use word dot care at. I need to go to the last index. So for that I can use word dot length. Okay. Get the total length. Then minus 1. So let's consider this word. The total length of this word will be 5. So 5 minus 1 equal to 4. Why we need to subtract 1? Because the index starts from 0. So it will be like 0, 1, 2, 3 and 4. So I will get the last character which will be 1 and this will return you one character. So let me store into a character type. Now you see it is returning a type cal. I know that the last index or last character of every word is a integer. So instead of storing this variable to cal, what I can do, I can directly extract it as a numeric value. So for that I can use a method from character class character dot get 
numeric value and i can directly store into int and i can name it as index you can do in two lines also but what i did i just got the last character and then i am getting the numeric value of it because anyhow i need to get the index value so that only i can replace or set the word at its correct position now i can use this index for the new array words with correct position and here the new position or the correct position will be index minus 1 i need to remove this value right the last character so for that i can use the sub string word dot sub string it should start from 0 and word dot length and then minus 1 we already know that in sub string method the last index will be ignored so i just need to use the minus 1 only don't do minus 2 because if you do minus 2 then it will remove extra so after this iteration the this array will have all the words in correct position now i need to join all the values of that array so for that we have a method called join that is coming from string class string dot join and here you need to first parameter will be which delimiter you want to pass means which character you want to be used join the words so i'll use white space because i want to make sentence and i will pass the words with correct position now let me run the program and see whether it works or not okay so we can see it is giving me the expected output please note here i am using java 11 in the second approach you can use array list also instead of array so let me show that quickly because so let me copy this method and create a duplicate of it and i will name it like short sentence with array list so here obviously we need to split it but instead of creating the string array i will create a new array list so list of string word list equal to new array list and actually if you create the empty array list then it will be problem you cannot go and insert element on some random position random index this is the empty array list for the first iteration if i get 2 so if i go and try to add a new element at index 1 because 2 minus 1 it will give me index out of bound because this is now empty array list so what i need to do i need to create a new array list with the filled values so what i can do i can use this array only to create the array list so for that i can use list of and i can pass the words this is statement i don't require because i am using the array list now the iteration will go in this way only we need to get the correct position so simply i need to replace this line so i need to use word list and we have one method called set and we using this method we can replace the value so in this set method we need to pass the index in which index you want to replace the value the index will be index minus 1 and the second argument will be value you want to replace and same thing will go here because this join method will work for both array list and array so if i run the program now it should give me the same output okay so this is giving the correct output so that's all in this video if you have any doubt please comment on this video if you really like my videos please like comment subscribe and share with others thank you everyone